Top five ghosts call on camera. A playful spirit. Reddit user Bleachpong says that he and his brothers have experienced a very bizarre haunting throughout their entire childhood in their family home. They would often hear the sound of someone loudly digging through their large collection of Legos, even though there was no one else in the house. Late one night, they hear the familiar sound of shuffling Legos and run down the hall to record. They caught something incredibly creepy on camera. How long are you before you got me? It probably went for about 10 seconds, 10 or 15 oh, seconds. Let's watch it. Let's watch it. You'll watch it. Did you see it? There's nothing up here. A large Lego toy called a Bionicle seemingly turns its head to look at the boys. There's nothing up here. When Reddit users speculated that the toy was battery powered and that was why the head moved, Bleachpunk posted close-up pictures of the toy's neck to show that there was no mechanical mechanism at work. So, is Bleachpong and his family haunted by a child ghost who just wants to play Legos? Or is it all a hoax? You decide. By the way, you can check out Bleachpong's full continuing story over in the subreddit rparanormal. Look out. In this video, YouTube ghost hunters The Holy Walkers team up with several other popular YouTube ghost hunting channels to explore the haunted Medina Mansion in Florida. The house has a dark history as Mrs. Medina's life was taken by her husband in the home. Included in the investigating crew is Franco TV, Sea's Crazy Crossroads, and Urban Ghosts Urban Exploration. Frank from Franco TV decides that they should try a seance. And then things get a little spooky. Can you come closer to me? Oh my god. <sighs> Alright, so we all watch. Oh, work. my K2 is going off. Oh, what is that? Dude, what's up, first? Did you hear that? Alright, well, what's a question you want to ask? Can you make a sound? What the f is that? Oh, bro, bro. Don't move, don't move, don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Frank, bro. Don't move. No, that's, 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 that's the, the fucking front door. Yeah. No, but it's it's the it's the wood on it. I can see it from here. You guys. Oh my. That's yep. Sound like a crow. Oh, Todd, Todd. What? You're not in the right state of mind. Stop. You're not. Uh, in the right... Oh my goodness. Joe from Urban Ghosts Urban Exploration suddenly says. That his back is really burning. You guys, my back is burning. Oh no. Oh, it's my back. It's my back. Sure. It's burning really. Bro, what is that? Oh my right there? My back is burning. No. What you got like some kind of marks on your back. Look at that. Looks like it's all. God. Look what's up with my back. Yeah, There's like a mark right there. Like a bru oh. like a. I can't go up higher. Guys, guys, Pull guys, up higher guys, now. Guys, Shh. Shh. You see any more? There's one down here, like a big. Like, looks like someone hit you like a bruise. Hey, right. My back is burning up, man. Like, I feel like something like burned my back. That's what the freak. That's what it looks like. But by far, the most bizarre thing that the crew catches on video is something in the upstairs window. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, look, look in the window. Look in the window. There's a head. There's somebody looking at us. Look in that window. Look in that window. 
Dude, dude, are you kidding me? Somebody's here. What do we do? I don't think anybody lives there, bro. But what do we do? There's nothing there. What I'm gonna do? What do we do? There's nothing there, bro. Someone or something seems to be peering out at them from inside the house. But when they go inside to check, there's no one there. Hey, is anybody in this house? Oh, just taking out. pictures. Oh my God, that's freaking freak me out, man. Should we all go up? I don't know if you guys saw that there was something yeah. looking. Should we all go up there? Yeah. And now it's gone. I'm gonna check out the first floor. Joe, just be careful. Sure it was in that right, to the right, to the right. Yep. Well, obviously, you still have. All right, I'm gonna check out the first floor. Make sure you guys are well. See if I can. Hey, guys. Yeah. Was it this? So scary. Oh. That's where it was, right? That's the window, Joe. Let's check the attic. Somebody's here. There's somebody that was a face. But this story takes another very odd twist. Because a few days later, Joe from Urban Ghost Urban Explorations decides to return to the house by himself. And he accidentally catches more creepy footage as he speaks to the camera. Pretty sure that there's people outside. And I'm pretty sure this place is freaking haunted. I guess what, what has me uh, the most freaked out about this place is the fact that, like, um, I left the other day with such a feeling of, like, helplessness. And I was, I was burned on my back, you know, so it kind of makes me want to come back here. Some bizarre shadow figure that looks almost like the silhouette of a young girl keeps peeking around the corner behind him. So did these ghost hunters catch real paranormal evidence? Or is it all an elaborate hoax? You decide. The House of the Devil Ghost hunter Abdullah Al-Ambari explores supposedly haunted locations around his country of Saudi Arabia and streams them live on Snapchat. In this video, he's visiting a haunted house known to local ghost hunters as, quote, the house of the devil. As you might expect, it doesn't go well. Bismillah. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Bismillah. Bismillah. 
بسم الله بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله اقسم بالله يا جماعه اقسم بالله ما انا عارف امشي بسم الله بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ايش اللي سوي هنا استغفر الله العظيم بسم الله بسم الله بسم الله Abdullah Al Ambari decides to finally just get out of there. You can watch more of Abdullah's adventures over on his YouTube channel or live on his Snapchat. Ghost in the Cabin Paranormal investigator Ricky Velasquez is live streaming his exploration of a haunted cabin in the middle of nowhere. As he approaches the building, he sees something absolutely terrifying. Amazingly, Ricky charges toward the building. He searches the structure, but he finds no sign of the strange woman he saw in the window. So did he see a ghost? Or did Ricky Velasquez somehow manage to fake a disappearing woman on an actual live stream? <laughs> 